Is there an overreaction regarding Jack Grealish? England didn't know him three games ago. Well, that's not true. England did know him three games ago. They've been trying to talk the lad. I know this uh, because I know the people who work at youth level. They've been trying to talk him round to playing for England in the last few years, but he's decided that he wants to play for us. I had hoped that that would continue on. I don't know what's going on behind the scenes, but he's certainly a player that we would love to have. Is there, is there an overreaction? Uh, to the criticism of the boy? Well, just generally. Is that what the you whole mean? Lot? He's oh, been uh, criticised in social media because he hasn't yeah, chosen which to go for us. Well, that's, that's the, the norm awful, nowadays. Yeah. That's the norm nowadays. Yeah. Uh, I think the kid wants to be sure when he makes it's a huge decision. Uh, but I fear that the fact he's dwelling so long to do it that we may not get him. I think the remarks made... I think he's, he and his father, who is a big factor here, uh, and a presence, they deserve... Uh, they, it's their right, their prerogative, and we should be patient and hope he, he decides to play for Ireland. Roy Keane made a remark about his father that was unfortunate, sarcastic, and would not have been proper conduct and was intemperate. And Martin O'Neill made a remark the day before the English uh, Cup semi-final uh, when he was the man of the match against Liverpool, which Aston Villa won, saying that he thought the Scotland match would be too big for the lad. Uh, well, he played and was man of the match in the semi-final. Uh, I don't think Scotland would have been, but that was a, an, an ill-advised remark. If you was feel it not it, fair comment at that time? Because no. we hadn't seen him in the cup well, semi-final. I know he was brilliant, but, you, but we didn't know. He, he was played involved. a couple of senior Tim games Sherwood for Villa. plucked him out of reserves to get involved in a fight for Aston Villa's life to stay in the Premier League, and he has been magnificent. And he was again last Saturday. So this is a good, promising young player. Remarks made by O'Neill and Keane have not been helpful to the cause of getting him to turn out for Ireland, in my opinion. Richie, what, what, what advice would you give Jack Grealish, his dad, as Eamon says, is his, his guiding light in this situation? I think I agree with it. It's a huge decision that he is to make. And if he's unclear about what his decision is, he's right to take it as long as he needs to take it. I would suspect he's made up his mind privately that he's not going to be an Irish international again. I don't know why you would be unsure. He's been in the FAIC now for years, so we know what's involved. He made the statement that he's out of international football till September to concentrate in club football. He'll be back for the 21s then. That doesn't add up. For me, um, I would be surprised if he plays for us again. He's got to go where his heart tells him mm. to go. Not his head, his heart. Yeah, that's what Kenny Cunningham said on the game on last night. Okay, guys, thanks very much indeed. Uh